Hey learners, welcome to my channel guys. This is Ranshi Burma and in today's video we are going to learn power theft and energy management, some sort answer type question and answer. And guys, this is your electrical branch subject, ECE. Okay, let's begin. And this your first question is, list the different source of energy. Answer is, the following are the source of energy. First one. Fossil sources like coal, gas, oil and nuclear energy. Next one, non-conventional energy source like solar, wind, ocean thermal, geothermal, tidal energy, machinery to hydrodynamic, chemical energy source and thermoelectric power. So they are different types of source of energy. Okay, next question. What is power theft or pilferis? Answer is... Altering, modifying or damaging in any style, interfering with or upsetting the function or composition of any authorized measuring device for measuring or registering, registering the utility service is called power theft or pilferers. Okay, next question. What are selling and tempering in power system? Answer is. Sales on the meter or barge docks are not expected to act as look to any forceful entry but are temper evident seal. T E S. Lead seals. Lead seals are used. The seals disclose the history only when the utility sleuths inspect its neck it next time. Tempering in power system is damaging the measuring system in any style or form meant for recording or measuring purposes of power. Next question. What is harmonics and how it, how it affects the power losses? Answer is harmonics are the integral multiple of fundamental frequency. When electrical current pass through any circuit, there will be some losses depending upon the load circuit. Due to vibrant characteristics of load, the current may become complex in characteristics and are superposition with the fundamental frequency causing positive, negative and zero sequence current and developed power losses. Next question. List the type of power meters. Answer is following are the power measuring meter. First one, electromechanical meter. Uh, second one, Electronic meter, third one prepaid meter, fourth one is smart meter, and fifth one is tribector meter for measuring up apparent act line and re reactive power. Next question explain energy, demand, supply, crisis, and future scenario. Answer is supply. The quality of energy supplied is the flow of energy brought onto the market. Demand is the quality of energy demanded is the amount of energy purchased for a particular period of time. Crisis, it often refers to a decrease in the supply of electricity as compared to its demand. Future scenario, in the next decade, India needs to increase the generating capacity to 1100 gigawatt, about 2.5 times more that of today. We have to depend upon the coal, gas and nuclear power source in future. Lot of the solar plant are being put into the national grid. The Indian power sector needs huge investment. Foreign investment and private participation can solve this problem to some extent. Next question. Explain meanings of power theft and reason of power pilferage. Answer is meanings of power theft. Firstly, we will see meanings of power theft. There is a power theft all over the world. Like any commodity, electricity can also be stolen. Generally, power sleds find hard to believe and still hard to prove it. The total energy loss including theft all over the world was 1148.58 billion unit in 0.58 billion unit in 2004. The energy loss and the theft rose to 85% during the last quarter of century. It was just 617.68 billion units in 1980. India is losing almost half of its produce. Power theft is crime 
in terms of cost and safety all utilize know the pain of power theft a study shows 80% of total power theft detected all over the world is from dwelling places and 20% from commercial and industry okay now reason of power theft first one is for saving utility bill second reason is where electric will pay here electric will play a major role in the cost of production of industry for example steel ice factory plastic injection modeling okay next one is to overcome certain regulations especially during power cut and during peak load and restrictions next is to avoid consequential consequential taxes in which means labor charges is paid based on unit consumers in a day five for social and psychological reason for porting a false image in the public next one is some people do it as a sign of revolt and try to justify it as they feel they will not get caught okay can okay, next question is what methods power thieves use in electromagnetic measuring answer is following are the methods apply for power theft in am meter em stands for electromagnetic okay first one power is multiplication of voltage and current so disturbing the voltage and current circuit next one bypassing the meter outside style the next bypassing the meter inside style next drilling hole in the meter next insertion of film into meter next looping of supply from incoming wires next direct tapping from incoming wires and services wires next theft by convenience of utility staff next energy meter tampering next partial earth fault next missing neutral next cross potential methods and next one is direct tapping from overhead okay next question what method power thieves used in electronic metering following our answer is following are the methods apply for power theft in electronic meter first one by changing the multiplication factor second one altering the burden of ct next one providing shunt across ct next one by removing the ct by suppress effect on ct next one disturb disturbing voltage circuits next one by means of electrostatic discharge next one by tempering pcb next one by tempering the frequency circuit and display circuit next one by interfering count circuit and next one tempering of real time clock and next one by using magnets and disturbing magnetic field many other types of methods are being adopted in pill phrases okay guys now let's find up this lecture see you in the next video thanks for watching guys wish you a very very all the best for your examination